this was not how this was supposed to go. Okay. So I came into my grand- this is in focus. So I did do a voiceover for this video, right? And so I came into my grandparents' camper because it was gonna be like a quiet, nice place. I'm like, it's perfect. Whatever. Um, I brought my dog with me. And um, so I set up, I have my computer here. I was setting up my camera. All of a sudden, the door, the outside door, slams close and locks. <laughs> And I brought my phone in here, and, um, I lost it. And now me and my dog are just trapped in here. So I think I'm just gonna film my video and hope that I either I find my phone or my family remembers I'm in here, because I literally have no way to get out. The door's locked. I don't know how to unlock it. Maybe I do. I, I, I don't know. Like, simple stuff like this, I just don't understand. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm sorry. Why do you have to look at me like that? It's not like you make mistakes. At least I don't chew up the carpet. Alright, now that we have all my issues worked out, um, we can continue on with the video. So, me and my sister decided to give my dog a photo shoot. And we kind of got inspired off of those milk photo shoots like in the bathtub except I wasn't gonna put my dog in milk water like just no anyway so we found this tub and we're cleaning it so it looks dirtier than it is that's just because it's full of dried cement but I promise it's perfectly clean my dog was not a fan of this process at all so I just filled it up and before we went to doing the photo shoot we had to tire out my dog otherwise there was absolutely no way she would sit in there because she is a corgi and she's very high energy. So I picked some dandelions, some leaves, and we prepped it, made sure my dog was okay with it. As you can see she's fine. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Let yeah. me grab more carrots. That's a good meal. I know that was so good. 